Well, hi there, and welcome to the Singapore series. Today, my friends, we will be trying a tea from the Griffon, Griffon, Griffon Tea Company. This is a manufacturer that is um, in Singapore, the, and I have not had any of their teas. Um, I was hoping that I could, you know, just kind of show up to the factory and, and you know, get a tour or something. Um, but yeah, that didn't, that didn't go. Um, Cause one, we were too busy doing all this other stuff. Um, and then two, I figured out that you could actually buy this tea in some of their grocery stores. So I don't know. I mean, most of these teas, well, no, I've got them all around. It's, I got them all over Singapore. So anyway, we're gonna try the green tea today. So from the Griffin Tea Company, we will be trying the artist selection, and I'm gonna say it wrong, Hanami. It is Japanese Sencha with cherry blossom. It's, it is blend number 152. There are 20 silken sachets in this box. It says, and I'm gonna say it wrong again, Hanami, the Griffin Tea Artisan Selection. Indulge in Griffin Tea Artisan range inspired by our passion for an exquisite tea drinking experience in every cup. Each silken sachet promises a devotion to deliver the world's finest hand-picked tea leaves and herbs. Crafted exclusively by our master tea blenders, experience the richness, richness in every cup. All right, tasty notes, soft textured floral notes, and sweet fruit rest on an appealing structure of green tea with notes of, a villa, notes of vanilla astringency. We brew at uh, or below 80 degrees Celsius. We brew for three to four minutes. Uh, our favorite pairings, it says, the fine astringency of Sencha pairs completely or competently with both sushi and a delicate desserts. Serve without milk. Our ingredients are steamed green tea, cherry blossoms, and flavor. All right, on the other side of it, it says, with each melting of deep winter, frost brings the annual blossoming of wild cherry trees. In traditional Japanese customs of flower viewing, families and friends would gather to celebrate the oncoming of spring. Inspired by tradition, Griffin Hanami is created to capture poetry in motion, marrying the delicate nuances of green tea with the enticing notes of cherry blossoms, offering refreshing flavors of spring and the promise of a new beginning. It is made with passion. All right, let's, let's get into it. I can't wait. I can't wait. All right, uh, the box is just a slick cardboard. It is foiled uh, with the name, the Griffin name. So that's kind of nice. Uh, you can either open it from the top uh, since I crushed in the sides, but there is a little tear, uh, tear here thing at the bottom. So we're gonna go ahead and tear at the bottom and for once do what we're told. We do what we're told, told to do. All right. Okay, so we'll stick this there with our bat tea friend. If you have any names for the bat tea friend that is not batty, please leave it in the comments below. I would love to hear it. I am up for a name. All right, so we have a nice uh plastic pouch it is not foil but that's all right uh, you can it is translucent you can see through it um let's see it is the same information it does say three grams per sachet uh sachet is another word for rupaul and spencer and my language that's not english that's just spencer and i being the cheeky things we are oh this is interesting. It is not a triangular silken sachet. It is a square one. 
that I like that that fills the bag that's quite lovely it smells like a green tea I can't really smell any of the cherry in it um, let's see we warmed up off screen and how long hey Siri set a timer for three minutes All right, three minutes is the middle one. That's the green one. Um, it's not, you know, even though it's not a foil pack, it's still kind of pretty. Um, it is completely sealed though. It's in the pouch. It just smells like green tea still. So three grams per sachet, and that's very interesting because most American teas have two grams per sachet. Uh, so this is interesting that it has three. Um, that should give a really nice, bold cup of tea. Uh, I am very much looking forward to that. Hey Siri, stop timer. Okay, so our three minute timer has elapsed. And let's grab our reappropriated toast tongs. And we will try to grab that better okay we'll try to grab that better again um, I really do like that they've got enough room in this darn it Linda in this tea bag uh, for the the leaves to to blow up like they should um, a lot of sometimes I'm not sure if those silken bags leave enough room um, for the the leaves to expand so uh, I kind of like that. Kind of like that a lot. Uh, all right. So if we are on the urine scale, this is please drink more water uh, before you go to the med lodge. Uh, Chardonnay scale is a I would not drink that. Um, there's a little bit of particulate in it, uh, but it is transparent. You can see completely through it. Smelling it in the cup, it smells very soft and delicate. Um, I actually wouldn't mind having a fragrance like this because um, it smells floral uh, without being overwhelming. It's just light and delicate. Yeah. Ooh, that's quite lovely. That is quite a lovely tea. It is light and delicate. Ooh, and okay, so in the aftertaste, That's kind of sweet and um, kind of perfumey. That's interesting. Having it with the sencha, which sencha to me has always had a very vegetable flavor to it. I'm not getting that in this. I'm getting a very light, lovely green tea flavor with a very nice cherry floral taste. It is mixed well. It is, it is beautiful. Um, if you think you've had a, a green tea with cherry blossom before, you haven't had this. This is amazing. I've never tasted a tea like this before. That is freaking delightful. I, I don't know what else to say about it. That, wow. I, like I said, I really wouldn't mind having a fragrance like this it is quite delightful wow all right well thanks so much for coming by and having a cuppa with me today i really appreciate your time and i'm glad that you chose to spend a little bit of it with me doing our singapore series um thank you so much and i look forward to seeing you next week when we try another delicious tea bye